Hello, today I just wanted to talk to you about uh, Johanna on Tomb of the Spider Queen, one of her more popular maps, especially for coordinated play. And I wanted to talk about, ever since her trait nerf, how much more dangerous it is to step in aggressively to collect gems. Um, so something to be aware of, uh, usually you draft Johanna on this map as a wave clear tank, so you can walk far into the wave and collect the gems pretty safely while also using Condemn and sometimes Punish to uh, quick clear the waves, especially if you take Eternal Retaliation on 4 or um, the Shield Glare bonus damage does similar. Sin's exposed, there you go. Um, but one thing to note, especially in coordinated play or high level play, they will punish you uh, every time you step too far up and the te opposing team is here with their wave they will step up and try and beat you up as much as possible and attempt to burn your trait and this is in part because then when you go for your next rotation you can't step aggressively forward because you won't have trade up again even with hold your ground the cooldown is not short enough to be back up when you rotate from here to here anymore um, previously it was only a few seconds off so you could usually time it within reason uh, now it's just not a realistic option so, you can see the May here was trying to slow her down and pop, have the Johanna pop her trait. So, Johanna steps aggressively in, clears the wave, loses, let's say, 25% of her life in the process, and is in relatively good shape, but the problem is the entire team is here, and her team's over here, and not necessarily looking for a full-on conversation. So, the May comes back in from previously was top... Uh, comes out of the bush, slides in, and boom, Legacy's in now and slowed. And so what happens is the whole team turns on uh, Johanna here. And so because she does not pop trade immediately, you can see she loses almost all of, uh, essentially a third of her life total and goes down to about a third and has to burn trait. And even with all that, the May is body blocking her, and had there been one less team member here, or had they been less scared of tower damage, perhaps have trade up, she could have body blocked her all the way to the gate, and then just popped uh, trade and eat out again. So, for all that, uh, the Johanna lost about two thirds of their life and burned trait which will not be back up for this if she just mounts and goes immediately, so she's forced to tap. And again, if she goes immediately there, this will not be up. She has to take a little while to head back up, and it'll just come off cooldown as she arrives. But it's just an example of one aggressive rotation, which is the same one that's made again. Like, aggressive push in a wave, rather, not aggressive rotation. Uh you can easily get chunked out for a significant portion of your life toll and not necessarily have iron skin to continue pushing with such aggressive uh, waves and continue your normal rotation timing. So something you want to keep in mind as a Johan player, you may have to skip a rotation or just wait for the waves to crash instead of aggressively pushing for gems. It's okay to give up gems. One of the worst things you can do as a Johanna is if you end up collecting the majority of those gems by aggressively stepping into waves you can see here uh legacy has 22 gems in it at their disposal uh you might die and if you die as the tank realistically none of your teammates can step up and collect your gems safely there are a few exceptions but in general they're just not, not going to be able to do so and so it's doubly important you do not necessarily take aggressive approaches into the waves against a comp that can burst you down. And any comp with uh, Jaina and Greymane and potentially an Ana as well to prevent other outside healing, not to mention Sleep Dart, is definitely one that can do so. So that's it. Just a reminder that with the trait nerf, uh, you should not be pushing into waves nearly as aggressively as the majority of you are currently. And I hope that helps. Thanks for listening.